Look at these two. They're like, we're just looking out the window together. Good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. We're going camping today. Look at how cute they are, just looking out the window together. Shelby seems to be doing okay today. She ate about half of her breakfast. We're gonna try to give her a little bit more before we get on the road. She's doing all right. She's not doing as good as she could be, but I think she's doing good enough to go on a camping trip. Oh my gosh, I could just sit here and stare at you both all day. You're so stinking cute. Hey, she's feeling good enough today to want to play with Kira a little bit. That's a good thing. She's like, I really want pets from Dad, but I kind of want to play with this puppy. She stops as soon as you pet her, and then she's like, back to attack. <laughs> oh, get her, Selby. You get her. She's like, how about we look out the window together again? That was more fun. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you don't even know what's going on. You know what's going on. You know what's going on. You want to go camping? You want to go camping? Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Sebby's like, I know this drill, guys. I know what we're doing. Don't you want to go? She's like, I just think you're going to put that harness on me, and I don't know how I feel about it. So I'm not sure yet. Oh, why do huskies hate harnesses? Why? Why do you hate your harness? It always leads to good things, but you still hate it. Anyway, we're loading up. Oh, I heard you. We're loading up, we're hitting the road, we're going camping! I don't think I've filmed anything since we've gotten in the car, but we made it to the bridge. <laughs> it was like magic, we're at the bridge. All the dogs are chilling in the back. What do you think? Sebby's chilling, Memphis is in her seat over there. They're having a good ride and what, what? You're so stinking cute, you really are. They got high winds on the bridge, so we're supposed to go slow. Hey look, there's some of the fairies going over to the island. Boom! Holy cow! I don't know if I can zoom in on that. Hold on. Alright, I don't know how still I can hold this camera, but watch that boat hit those waves and the front end of it come out of the water. Boom! That was a good hit. Yeah, no thank you. I don't want to be going across the lake today, thanks. There's the pillars of the bridge. They're painting them. I'm surprised that they're still doing it, considering the bridge walk is Monday. But I guess, uh... I guess that's what they're doing. Work, work never stops. That does not look like fun to me. I mean, yeah, it's work, but that does, no. I don't want to work that high up, thanks. Right. Crossing the bridge. There's Memphis. <laughs> so we actually checked the weather and it looks like it's gonna be beautiful this whole trip. I hope it doesn't change. Looks like it's supposed to be in the 70s and be nice every day. I don't think we've actually had a camping trip where we've been nice every day in a long time. So, so don't count on it. Yeah, I was going to say, so it might not actually happen. But the other thing that won't happen because it's all over the news right now is the chance of northern lights all throughout the weekend. Now, whenever the news media runs with these stories and they're like, you're going to see the northern lights further south than you can normally see them and they're going to be out, it never happens. It never does. But maybe we'll get lucky. I would really like for it to happen because Charles is coming and he's, I think he, he's seen what, once with us? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think. and I don't think they were the greatest, and you could really only see it in the camera. I don't, yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember either, but I'm really hoping. I'm seen hoping. some good ones, so. Yeah, I'm hoping that it does actually happen tonight, or this weekend, and we get to see some northern lights. I tell you what, it is really nice out right now. Besides the wind making it so we can only go 20 miles an hour across the bridge. That's why everybody's passing us. We have a trailer. <laughs> Shelby knows. She's like, get my nose out is air. I can, we're up north. They brought me up north. Are you excited? Are you excited? Yeah, we're up north. You like it up north, don't ya? Heck yeah. Oh look, there's even a little Shelby smile. I see that. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, look at that. There's my girl. We made it to the trees. I forgot there, that these trees grew up really big so we can't see anything. Uh, you can see now. And we made it to Munising. Pictured Rocks is over there. That's Grand Island. That's where we went to the Grand Island ice caves. It's starting to get a little bit dark. Um, whoops, I dropped my phone. Anyway, we're 
We're getting up here a little bit later. We're about two hours, a little less than two hours from the campground. Getting up here a little bit later than we anticipated, but we wanted to make this as easy on Shelby as we could, so we had to stop a couple times and let her out and kind of, you know, just let her, well, look at that sun. Just let her chill out a little bit so that the ride's not super stressful. She is sound asleep in the back right now, though, which is perfect. So yeah, we just drove through Munising, and Greg and Eric are actually up ahead of us a little ways, so I don't think we're gonna catch them, but we're not really trying. Anyway, stare at that sun with us for a little while, guys. <laughs> yeah. That's like, yeah. Are you staring at the sun? What are you doing up here? We're out of the city limits. You're supposed to be in the back. You're only allowed to stand up here when we're going slow. I'm going to have to put you in the back now. Look, guys, we made it. <laughs> it's Kira's first camping trip. And guess who else's first camping trip it is? <gasps> Lana, you went over there where I can't see you. Look at you, see your little red collar? <gasps> Lana! It's Lana's first camping trip! <laughs> Yay! You it's your first camping trip and her first camping trip. The puppies get to go camping. What do you think, huh? Everybody's setting everything up. Uh, Greg and Eric built a fire before we got here. Need some doggy lights. Oh yeah, we got LED collars. We could you put your LED collars on, your Canadian LED collars. Oh, that's very good, Kira. Kira's learning patience and learning how to not make a lot of noise at the campground. That takes a lot of patience from me too, which I'm tired and don't necessarily have, but we're working together, right, baby? Yeah, I know, we're working together. We're trying. Hey, it's all right. It's okay, it's all right, hi. Yeah. And Shelby's over there like, this air feels amazing. It's only like 47 degrees outside and we're loving it. Did you find your favorite spot? Oh yeah, I felt that sigh too. She's like, guys, I found my favorite spot. Emphasis in her spot. Kira is over here. She found her toys. What do you think of this little mini house on wheels, huh? Your friend Lana's here. You're kind of sleeping outside, but you're inside. How do you feel about this? We brought her some toys to play with. I have some other toys somewhere in here. I just have to find them. Your first time camping. Your first time sleeping in a camper. It's so cute. What do you think? It's like, I don't know. I'll let you know more what I think about this camp and stuff tomorrow. I did want to tell you guys. Oh my goodness. Hi, Shelby. This probably isn't going to be a lot like our normal camping videos because Shelby can't do as much as everybody else can. So we won't be doing a ton of hiking. We're probably going to go still see a few things and it all depends on how she feels. She ate breakfast this morning. She didn't want to eat any lunch, but of course we were in the car. So I'm sure she probably was a little unsettled and uh, I've been giving her some time to settle down here. She probably ate a quarter of her dinner. I figure I'm gonna let her nap for a little bit and then I'll try to give her a little bit more and see if she'll eat it. So we'll see. We're just working through this little by little. Somebody said the other day, I don't like to see Shelby sad. Shelby always kind of has a, that kind of a look to her sometimes too, that attitude -y look. She's really happy to be here though. She was super happy to see Greg, weren't you? Greg took you for a walk around the whole campground. It's probably why she's pretty tired right now too. She wanted to walk, so he took her. Yeah? What do you think? Well, all right. I think, I don't think we're going to bed yet. So I won't say goodnight just yet. All right. So I'm gonna insert some photos of the Northern Lights right here.
yeah, so we knew that there was a good chance of Northern Lights this weekend. I thought it was going to be more like this weekend, not necessarily tonight. But I got on Facebook and there was a bunch of people posting pictures in the group. So Jamie stayed here and hung out with the dogs. And Greg and I took off and got some pictures. And the dogs were all exhausted. I think uh, she likes this bit. <laughs> She like this bit? What do you think about camping so far, babe? She's like, I don't care as long as I'm with you guys. I'm tired, it's late. Yeah, she's tired. It's two in the morning. Yeah, Shelby did pretty good. She's ready to sleep too. So we're calling it a night. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks for watching. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Good night, audience. If you love our huskies, Come along for the ride All you have to do is hit subscribe Follow as we share our lives with our dogs And join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs